Hello, I'm Clinton Clegg, a simulation specialist here at the Weiser Center in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Today I'd like to talk to you a little bit about our audio video system provided by KB Port. KB Port's ETC Fusion is the newest addition to our audio video system here at Weiser. It combines ETC software with new HD IP cameras and cross platform compatibility. The newly designed interface allows for effortless recording and debriefing. Video, audio, event logs, and patient monitors are captured in real time with no need to import files after recording. In this brief video, I'm going to give you a very simple demonstration of the functionality of our new system. And one of the key functions is this new system is all web-based, easily accessible through any web browser from any computer in your center. I'm using Firefox. Um, a lot of the plugins seem to work best with Firefox. It's also what uh, ETC and KB Port recommends. So what we're seeing here, once you're logged in, what you're seeing here is your home interface of your live screen. So right now we are live in the Wiser Center. This is a uh, Met 10, and we have three cameras set up and a patient monitor, all live streaming. As we see, as we look at it here, now, the live is pretty straightforward. One, you know, you can point and click to control any camera just with your mouse. As I'm doing here, you can also. If you don't like that feature, you can go down here to this tab, your video controls tab, and bring up and take control of any camera. Take control of this camera, and if you pop this out, we have more of a manual control, which can be helpful. You can go back to any camera and, and do the same. This is a standalone camera, so it doesn't have any movement with it, so that wouldn't work there. But So then on the right in this lower video controls tab, you can also go back to your all view, and there are also some custom views, picture in picture. You can do a quad view of just your cameras. And this is a custom view that you can also make. And you can maximize and, and full screen too, closing different tabs. But I prefer this all view in the live setting. I, f I feel it works best. Okay, so the other portion of this is for when you actually want to make a recording. So once you have your camera set up, you have your patient monitor set up, this, this software works independently of whatever simulator software you're running in a sense. So it doesn't work, for example, we use Laridol here at Wiser. It doesn't work as a debriefing system uh, built into the Leap software. It, it, it functions independently. Um, so what, what that means is you'll want to hit record every time. So you're not, as in the old software, you'd hit record within the Laridol software to make your recording, but but in this software, you're gonna and the way this system's set up, you're just gonna hit record on your own and you're rolling. Um, at that point, you're 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 move you're off and moving and everything's recording. There's different things within these tabs and, and we can we can get to all that. Uh, the first thing that I want to point out is if we're running an actual simulation on the right here and your events and flags. Everything you did as you proceeded would come up. Just uh, your log files, all your log files, and everything in the scenario would come up here on the right. And, or you can choose to hide that as well. And all the same video controls are available within the recording also. So we've made our recording. I'm going to hit stop here. We're going to go into part two of this video, which is the debriefing section found here. So 
So you've made, these are all different sessions that we've gone through here at Wiser. So let's just take a look on the right here. This, this is your file browser that has all your recordings through it. Um, this is one that I made earlier. And on the right is your actual video. So once you've pulled up what you wanted to pull up, you can kind of hide this and get into watching your actual recording of your scenario. See the patient monitor built in, popping up an x-ray, popping up a 12 lead. And then go back to your file. And do that like that. So you could debrief essentially right off of the website, just like that. There's also an export feature. You can edit within this software, export anything you might like to have, and it's very handy. I hope this video was helpful. Be sure to visit us at wiser.pit.edu, follow our YouTube channel, and check us out on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you.